The Tropicana is nearing the end of its era on the Strip. It's set to close down in just nine days. And now longtime employees are looking back at the Tropicana's 67 iconic years in hospitality and show business. You've got a mix of feelings. You've got people that have been here over 50 years and they've spent their life here. After 67 years on the Las Vegas Strip, the Tropicana is closing its doors for good on April 2nd, making way for the new A Stadium. It was really cool to perform at the Tropicana nightly. Lots of history there in that room, big shows. The Purple Rain Prince tribute show spent seven years at the Tropicana, the longest residency stay in the show's history. It was a good venue and, and a good move for us. While most of the entertainment shows like Purple Rain and Michael Jackson and live have already moved to other venues. Many hotel staff still remain on property during the final week, now reflecting on decades of memories on this iconic corner. I wanted to work at a, a hotel that basically had some history to it. When I got here, I could sense that there was a family atmosphere here and, and the people were very friendly. The people wanted to, to be a part of something. So I felt that right away and ended up staying here 10 years. Over the years, Paul Stefani has worked at several restaurants at the Tropicana, and he's proud to have been part of the property's rich history. You hear the stories uh, from some of the workers, some of the casino floor workers who've been here through thick and thin. Stefani says the Culinary Union and the Tropicana have been supportive, holding job fairs and helping the staff with severance or relocation. And although he's not sure what's next for him, he says a game at the new A Stadium is definitely in his future. Oh, no doubt. Oh, no doubt. And, and, and you know, I'll, I'll know approximately where I'm sitting to where the hotel was or where the parking lot was. It's That, that part's going to be fun. And as for the Laugh Factory Comedy Club at the Tropicana, their last shows there are going to be next weekend, and that's when they'll be announcing their new location.